Hello students and welcome parents. Today I am going to teach you English vocabulary and we are going to study jumbled words. Look here children, as you can see I have written few jumbled words. As you all know that jumbled means the words which are not arranged correctly. G R H B T I are you able to understand this word students? No. So what we will do? We will arrange this jumble word into the correct word. As you can see I have underlined B. That means we have to start the word with the letter B. So the correct word will be B R I G H T bright. This is the jumbled words, word students, and we have written it correctly. The correct spelling is B R I G H T bright. The next one R S U M E M. Now, what do we have to do? We have to change this word and write the correct word. We have to start with the letter S. So the correct spelling is S-U-M-M-E-R. Summer. The next one. A-M-R-E-A-I-T-L. We have underlined the letter M. So we have to start with the letter M. The correct spelling is M A T E R I A L material understood children very good moving on to the next one G E U O N T and we have underlined the letter T that means we have to start with the letter T so the correct spelling is T O U N G E Tongue. Understood children? Very good. Now students look at the board. Arrange the jumbled words. So here I have written few questions. We have to arrange these words correctly. Number 1. O W Y L S L And I have underlined the word S. So we have to start the word with the letter S. So the correct word will be S L O W L Y. Slowly. Number two, U E S H O. And I have underlined the letter H. So the correct word will be H O U S E. House. Number three, I N H T G. So the correct word will be N I G H T. Night. Number four, M B U H T. And I have underlined the letter T. So the correct word will be T H U M B. Thumb. Number five. M E M S U R. So the correct word will be S U M M E R. Summer. Number six. N U N S Y. So the correct word will be S U N N Y. Sunny. Number seven, T M O H U, and I have underlined the letter M. So we have to start the word with the letter M. So the correct word will be M O U T H, mouth. Now, students, moving on to another topic that is missing letters. As you can see, I have written few words over here. And what do we have to do? We have to fill in the missing letters. 
So let us start, students. Number one, P dash B dash L dash S. So we have to fill in. So P E B B L E S Pebbles. Very good. The next one C H E E K Cheek. The next one D R E A T H breathe moving on to the next one students w a t e r p r o o f water proof now look here p e B B L E S pebbles C H E E K cheek B R E A T H breathe W A T E R P R O O F water proof now students look at the board fill in the missing Letters number one C dash I dash D R dash N. So we have to fill in the given missing letters C H I L D R E N. Children number two M dash M dash E dash S. So M E M B E R S members number three E dash B dash W E L B O W elbow number four dash R dash D dash E so B R I D G E bridge number 5 b dash a dash t i dash dash l b e a u t i f u l beautiful number 6 c dash l dash a r c o L L A R collar number seven N dash M dash E R N U M B E R number understood children now students moving on to the next topic that is homophones write the homophones of number one M double E T meat so the homophone of meat will be meat m e a t meat number 2 poor p o o r poor so the homophone will be p o u r poor number 3 t o 2 t w o 2 2 and 2 as you can see that the pronunciation is same, but the spelling is different. Number four, M A I L male, M A L E male. Number five, T H E I R there, T H E R E there. Number six, S A I L sale, S A L E sale. Number seven, O N E one, W O N 
one. So students, as you can see, these are homophones. In homophones, the pronunciation is same, but the spelling is different. So students, I hope you understood whatever I taught you today. Related to these worksheets will be uploaded on your school website. Kindly go through it and study properly. Thank you students.